during 2020 was really close collaboration, lots of short sprints. And actually the work improved dramatically. And I think for the agencies, they really got closer to our business problems. And that, that, that reaped us huge benefits. We spent a lot more time really trying to make sure everybody in our marketing teams have a voice and that we spend a lot more time getting diversity of thought in our work and in our everyday decisions. The creative diversity that we unlocked by bringing together you know, the best of the East and the best of the West in these integrated teams was really impressive and, and something we will continue to do going forward. There's two pieces of work in particular that I'm really proud of from 2020. The first one is the next phase of StorySign. So StorySign is an app we developed in 2018 with, with a long-term vision to be able to create a real-time translation tool that would translate written text into sign language. 2020 was a huge leap forward where we used machine learning, uh, our facial recognition, our, our handpoint recognition, our skeletal recognition to actually for the first time get really close to being able to do real-time translation of any language anywhere in the world. The other one is Sonic Escapes. Now Sonic Escapes is a beautiful simple piece of work that was basically designed to give people a short escape. It was at a time when we couldn't travel or travel was difficult and we'd all been in lockdown and life was pretty tough. So actually what we did was we created 3D binaural sound escapes. So that's, that's basically 3D sound. And people could download these short 10 minute escapes which would take you to kind of Mexico or Jamaica or Marrakesh. And you know, that was downloaded over three million times. It just shows the power of when you really bring technology and creativity together to do something really innovative. I think the two greatest learnings for me of managing a brand through the dual challenges of the pandemic, but also at a time when your brand is, is suffering, you know, an extreme reputational attack. The two biggest learnings are one, stay true to your purpose, focus on what you can control because you can't control the external narrative. And the second that's really important is regardless of what's said about you, regardless of you know what's imposed on you, stay true to trying to do good in your community. Be humble, be a source for good in the world and just keep moving forward.